Welcome back to my channel guys. So today I am going to be trying on some pregnancy clothing because this bump is just getting bigger. <laughs> Throughout this pregnancy I have gained a uh, belly. <laughs> Although most of my clothes are still fitting in the arms and the legs, they're not fitting in the belly anymore. I'm 29 weeks pregnant in my third trimester so these clothes they're just gonna need to stretch more. I have been putting off buying maternity clothes for ages because the clothes that I was wearing, like I could get away with some of them. Pretty much for my entire pregnancy, I've just been living in gym wear, which is something that, to be honest, I would normally wear most days anyway. However, the waistband on all of my gym leggings is just not fitting over this anymore. <laughs> I put in an order with Shein. Now, I know that people are gonna say that Shein's really bad, and I know it is. The unfortunate reality is that most places don't really do any good maternity gym wear specifically or even many maternity clothes and also if they do do maternity clothes it often comes at a premium because it's a premium label that it can add to it so ultimately if you're going to be making maternity clothes you're not going to be making as many units so then the price per item is more expensive and as someone who can't really afford to be going out and spending a hundred pounds on one top from Seraphine, um, Shein will do fine for me. This is my bag from Shein. However, Luke said to me today that I also have another bag to try on, which I definitely have not ordered anything. He ordered stuff from River Island and I have literally no idea what's in it. So my stuff from Shein is gonna be gym wear, pretty much just leggings. As long as I'm wearing high-waisted leggings, I'm quite happy to walk around and make it a crop top. These are the leggings I've been wearing every day in my pregnancy. I've got some Gymshark. These are a size medium and to be honest, they still do fit over my bump, but I can't wear them for that long. And these ones are some Be Able leggings. So first up, let's try our Shein haul. Rip into it. Oh, they're coming to... <laughs> I was, I was underwhelming them for a minute. I thought I got, all, I got two things in the post. Now these are all maternity, but I also got a size large just because all of the leggings that I've had from Shein, I think I've got a large because my bum is quite big. But sizing can be really off with Shein, so I always find that it's better to size up because you just never know where you're gonna get. First up is a size large pair of, oh my gosh, okay. <laughs> I don't even remember what I got. I did this like a week and a half ago. Um, like black flary leggings. They look fun, don't they? Um, they're meant to be, I'm sure they're maternity, but to be honest, they don't really look like they've got any maternity bit. Often you'll get like a large semicircle here to accommodate for the extra belly room. They just look like a pair of large flares. I'm not sure. Let's try them on. Okay, so I've got them on. They're a size large maternity and I'm really not sure that they even are. I mean, they do fit over the bump, but there isn't that much growing room really. Okay, so this is what we're dealing with. I think, to be honest, I actually quite like them. There is not much growing room in this belly. I would wear them over my belly like this for a few weeks. But when the time comes, and it will come, where I have to go under the belly, I would probably have to do that. Okay, so I've got the flares on, but I also have, I think this is the top, one, two, three, and four more things to try on. Oh no, and five. <laughs> I also bought a pair of, you know, like wristbands, because I saw that hack of someone on TikTok washing their face with these wristbands on to sort of water dripping down your hands and I thought that was genius, so I bought them. Next up, I'm going to try on a pair of brown ones. Now, this one actually has a belly pooch. There we go, that looks much more like it. I think these are a size large. Yes, they are. So they're a size large with a belly pooch this time. I'm sure these were meant to be maternity, but they'll do for now anyway. I also have a bomb scrunch on the back because like, to be honest, we ha you have to. These feel pretty thin, to be honest. 
and the waistband is much smaller than I'm used to. Normally they're like that big, but it's like that big, like an inch and a half. So these are brown. I thought they've also got the, they've also got a little pattern there. I don't know if you can really see. And I thought these would be really good coming into autumn because it's August now and I'm gonna be pregnant right up until mid October. So I thought, browns and those sorts of colours will make me feel really good and autumnal. Let's try them on. <laughs> I've got them on and first impressions, they feel comfortable. They don't feel too small. They're definitely not too big. As I said, Shein always size up. Okay, this is what we're dealing with down below. So there's a lot of nice room in the belly. I feel like this will stretch. I feel like this will stretch right up until I'm like, 40 weeks like don't know, out here or something so they feel quite roomy they are a little bit they're maybe a little bit tight on the actual waistband but which makes me think that like their sizings are just off like this is not a size large waistband <laughs> especially for maternity and when i say that i have a size large adidas pair of leggings maternity and they are way too big for me like they're massive so just shows sizings are off <laughs> but these are really nice okay up next i'm gonna try a top again I'm, i went for two crop tops i think one black and one white just because then i know that it won't necessarily have to fit over my bump because i like to wear my leggings up high waisted like this with a crop top so we'll see what i got maybe i got three i don't remember <laughs> first crop top i have is I'm pretty sure these are not maternity ones. These are just straight size ones. This is a crop top, light blue, and it's a size XL, because I thought it's gonna be at the top of my waist here. So where it normally would sit tight like that, it's gonna have to be a little bit more flush. It's gonna have to have a little bit of wiggle room in there. So I'm gonna try the blue one on. Okay, so this is the blue one. Let me tell you, this is not a size extra large. There is no way. I mean, I can get it on, but as you can see, it is tight. It's like the whole material is just covering up my chest. It fits pretty badly. This, I can't get over how this is an XL. Like, it blows my mind. I feel like I would need to get a size XXXL for this to fit comfortably. Okay, this one doesn't fit quite as badly. I think this one is a size XL as well. It's got a little cross detail here. It's short sleeved, which isn't something that I'd ever normally go for because I think it makes me look like, I don't know, I feel like it makes me feel like I'm really big and I've got big arms, I don't know. I think having my arms out like this makes me feel a little bit like grew from Despicable Me. I don't know why, it just does. I think it's quite cute, it fits a lot better than the blue one, so what I will say before I forget is that this blue one smells like fish. It stinks, it smells like fish. I have one more top, which I think is the exact same as the light blue, but in black. Again, it's a size extra large. Is it gonna fit like an extra large? Look at the size of it, it's tiny. That is not a size extra large, but we'll try it on and see. It also is really, really thin. It feels like, like it doesn't feel like a gym top. Gym tops are normally a bit thicker than this. So we'll try this on and see how we go. This one is the exact same as the light blue but it's in black, it's a size extra large. It feels like there's actually a bit more room in this one. It feels a bit stretchier. Doesn't fit quite as uncomfortably. Um, like it has got a stretch to it. It just feels really thin and like it's just cut all wrong. I definitely will keep this one. I think this is a nice, easy top to throw on if you're going to the gym. The blue one, I don't think it does anything for me, <laughs> but Hey ho, we are, we're in the situation we are. I feel a big bum right here, right here. 
There's a big bum. <laughs> okay, my last thing to try on from Shein is another pair of leggings. But these ones are grey. They have some banding here, so you do actually definitely have a belly pouch. And on the back, you have your bum scrunch as well, just because it does make it more flattering. Let's try these ones on. So these fit really well on the bump. They do not fit well everywhere else. Like they, they, they're a size large, but they do not feel like a size large. They're completely different. I think the material is different from the brown ones I tried on. They're not quite stretchy and as comfortable, a lot tighter on the legs. So, I mean, they'll be fine. Again, like I need a pair of leggings to go to the gym in. <coughs> the most important thing is that I fit the bump. And there's definitely room for growth in the bump area. So I'm happy with that. And that's everything I got from Shein for my gym clothes haul. I'm thinking about my River Island haul. I don't know if I'm gonna do this in the same video, just because this, I actually ordered more from Shein than I thought I did. I thought it was one top and two pair of leggings. So we've got three pairs of trousers and three tops. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna leave it here for this one. And if you want to see, what is inside my mystery, and it really is a mystery, River Island bag, then stay tuned and I'll shortly be releasing that video as well. In the meantime, please do subscribe, like and comment. It really helps. I'm a very, very small and new channel on here and it gives me something to do in my maternity. So feel free to give me a comment, like, subscribe, stay tuned. I've got everything in the bio that you would need. And hopefully see you soon for the next one. Thanks guys, see you later. <laughs>